back again with another music video reaction. My name is Josh. Thanks for checking out the channel. And if you click the thumbnail, you're here to check out some Dan Vasque. If you are unfamiliar, Dan Vasque is a singer out of Brazil that just kind of oozes charisma and awesomeness in general. I think that's a pretty succinct way to describe him. He's got a super powerful voice that really kind of dwells in that kind of rock metal genre, but can do pretty much whatever he wants, as I've come to discover recently, as you guys have helped me kind of go through his catalog of different music, everything from different theme show songs to musicals to Disney movies, and most recently even opera. And he's been able to pull it off all excessively well. One then popped up recently as well that I've actually been seeing for a little bit, and that's actually Beast in Black. And and that's a band that I had not actually ever heard before until I was told to check that out by a buddy of mine in Colorado. What's up, Brent? And I actually checked out their song, Blind and Frozen, and I absolutely loved it. And honestly, even while I was watching that one, I was in the back of my head. I was like, you know, I bet Dan Vasque pulled this off pretty well. And then lo and behold, he actually has a cover of this exact song from several years ago that I am just now getting to. So I'm very excited about that. And I'm also done waiting. So let's go ahead and check this one out. All right, let's see how this one goes. I have a feeling it's going to go well. <laughs> a lot of cool guitars in this song, too. I just do it.
Dan did not disappoint. All right, that was Blind and Frozen from Beast in Black. Okay, so my initial inkling was correct. Okay, A, I really, really dig that song. Like, after I heard it the first time from reacting to it on this channel, I actually did go download that one, and I've listened to it several times, especially while I'm driving or getting ready to go work out or something like that. It just gets me in a good mood and gets me going. And each one of those times, I've always in the back of my head, I'm like... I bet Dan would do this really well with his vocals and especially just being able to sustain those notes and bingo, bingo, that's exactly what that was. As soon as it started, I was like, oh my God, it sounds almost just like the original singer except a little Dan pizzazz on there and it's just really, really wonderful. I love the song, so it's already a plus to get started with, but then we throw his vocals in there, throw the intensity and just, again, the look of actually enjoying what he's doing with the metal guitar that was going there too and that also looked like he was having a great time playing that. That was fantastic. This is just right in the wheelhouse of exactly kind of like what I believe Dan was put on this planet to sing. Again, he can sing whatever he wants to, but this just seems like it's it's just pitch perfect, spot on, meant to be, if you know what I mean. And plus, I also enjoy the type of music, so I might be a little biased. Who's to say? That was fantastic, though. Please let me know some other ones to check out by Dan. I'm also going to have to check out some more from Beast in Black because I have actually have not gotten any more of theirs. And kind of seems like something I might enjoy. So let me know what you guys thought in the comment section and any other ones I need to check out. Don't forget, like, share, subscribe. Go to that subscribe button if you would. That'd be fantastic. And as always, you're awesome. Peace out.